Yeah, man, I say I'll praise Zanana. And the hour. For a shame, I'll shine, but I'll shame, I'll call for that shit. And double and ask to the apostles, to the elders of Great Mill Stone, Shalom, to all the brothers in Mount Union, pushing the shoot in our sincerity. I know all honesty, you know, um, this is the brother from the James, um, Jamaica Camp, um, Yashamai. I war. I know, um, basically, you know, I touch upon um, you know, this article, you know, it's come out about um, you know, the earth population is now, you know, 8 billion, right? And, you know, according to, you know, he's uh, Edom, right? Banking family. You know, they want to basically get rid of the majority of the world population according to what we feel and the Georgia Guidestone to get destroyed, right? Maintain humanity and a 500 million, right? So, he's not going to do a lot of things in order for, you know, to get that done, right? And according to what written, you know, and them sustainable development goes, goal number one is to get, what? get rid of poverty. Get rid of the poor and the earth, mainly our people, right? Can you remember that? See, this um, is an article from Science News. Basically, it says, it says the world, it says the world population has now reached eight billion. Right. Mm -hmm. It says, it says eight billion. That's that's the number of humans estimate, estimated to be alive on Earth right. on November 15. The global population reaches this landmark according to a, a projection from the United Nations okay. in addition to being um, in addition to being a cause for celebration the 8 billion milestone also brings important responsibilities and highlights related challenges for social and economic development. Then basically them say um basically I say in cause for celebration it's like you know they, they, they reach a landmark you are celebrated then and I say eight billion people from the earth eh, which you know people should be happy about it. But basically them I say it cause for um for concerns like economic development. Because basically we must say the more people upon the earth and the more economical problem we have. The more more to feed. See? So you have challenges in a society. See? So that's why if they might come with what? The whole sustainable development goals and all of this. See? Because hey, they won't have to as they react they bring out, they won't have to cut population. Cut the population. Yeah, cut the population down to a month where them when them claim claim that is um Sustainable, where, where them, where them, what is manageable for them, right. then, which is the higher elite, right. then, which them feel that them are, the, them are, the, them, them are player, them are play like God for the earth. That's why scripture says, say, the prayer they might deceive him. Because in my heart, I'm going to say, I'll be like God. Then, so basically, he more have to go contrary to the most. I said, the most I said, be fruitful and multiply. They more have to do what? Decrease the population. Yeah? Give me a arm, what's your arm, what's your I want to take a believe. Go on. Say one verse ten. Says um says yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea. Go on. So you must say the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea. Right. You know going back. You know going back to you know ancient Egypt. Right. The scripture tell you what happened back then. So the more them, them basically have quick, you know, four pains going back during the time of ancient Egypt, and the more them multiply, right? You know, from, from 2020, the whole thing started out 2020, you have um, a lot of people get lucky in the house. So, you know, a lot of, you know, a lot of things going on in turn, a lot of, you know, baby born, right? Coming up to now, right? So, when I tell now, when these wicked rulers or these banking family, they are getting ready now to get rid of the majority of the world population, and they're going to do it in our style. Right? And the main thing I'm going to use, you know, is, um, is um, famine. Right? According to prophecy. Because people tell us that um, many people, many of them that dwell upon the earth, shall perish of famine. Right? Ultimately, the ICBM missiles. Right? Go on, brother. It will be as the sun of the sea, Gun. which cannot be measured nor numbered. Gun. And, and, it says, 
and it shall come to pass that in give me a, give me um Isaiah no Isaiah 10 and verse 22 right, so Isaiah um, 10 and verse 22 Isaiah 10 and verse, verse 22 1 it says um it says for though thy people Israel John. is as the sand of the sea John, so you must say though my people Israel this is basically the so called Negroes today Latinos and also the Native American Indian right on sand of the sea so this yet is, what? Yet a remnant of them shall return. So yet a remnant shall return. So yet the children, the, 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 the children of Israel, it's like what the sun of the sea. Yet a remnant are going to return. Right, a selected few are going to return to the heavenly Father. Okay. Right, any idea? It's all about the elect. We've been saying it, we are continuing to say it. It's all about the elect because majority of people are going to get destroyed. You know, in this coming destruction, we prepare to take place right now. Right? Mm. Uh, remnant of them shall return. Gone. The consumption decreed, decreed shall overflow with righteousness. Gone. And, and basically, hey, when you check it, when you check the levels of uh, um, um, what these men apply to the plant the scripture said, so come let us, let us cut them out from being a nation. Mean? The name so of the name of Israel may be no more remembered in the earth. So basically, hey, them, them, them actually did it in a slavery coming up by destroying um, the minds of our people. Then, then um, taking out, taking out our true heritage from us, which you know the Lord of mercy are returning it in the earth to specific men. But guess what? Them here is actually if they fully get rid of um, the Israelites off on the planet. Then, so that's that they saw. When you see them come up and do the, um, the 8 billion thing, see? They don't know how much are the people from the earth are Israelites. See? Because when we scatter among all nations, see? that's why Lord said we cannot be numbered. See? And we start yeah. trying to do that. Yeah. Right? Um, give me a scripture. Many of them are Jewish, just like that. Um, give me a um, Hosea. Give me a scripture first. Second is us. 8 and verse 50. Uh, and, yet, and verse 50. 1. It says, it says, For many, it says, For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world. Can. Because they have walked in great pride. Can. So, you say, Many great miseries shall be done to them in the latter time. The last days, the last days we're living in right now. Right? Because they are walking on great pride, foolish pride too. Okay. Right, so Esau is getting ready to make we basically go all out against our people. Right? And we know a lot of these, you know, Eden nations are gonna get destroyed also, you know, in this coming destruction. Right? In, but understand thou for thy for thyself. So understand thou for thyself one and seek out glory for such as be like thee. Okay. So see just the glory for such as be like thee. Right. Right. Let the multitude perish that were born in vain. Yeah. So the majority of people born in vain. So it's all about the elect. Um, so my body tree. Body tree. Give me a second. Isaiah 15. 9 and 15. 9 and 15. Yeah. Um, uh, it's a second. Isaiah 9 15. It says, it says, I have said before and now do speak and will speak it also hereafter that there be many more of them which perish than of them which shall be saved. Can't say you say many more are perish right in this coming destruction we're preparing right now. You know, will take place. Many more are gonna perish than will get saved. So a lot of people are gonna get destroyed. Can't. Right? As the brother going to the article earlier that um no present you know is say Please, we say they have um, 8 billion people on earth right now, present, you know, right? But the things that will take place right in, in, in the near future of, of the destroy majority of the earth population. A lot of our people, right? Who to the people are going to get destroyed according to the number, yeah, because, right? Because one of the main things is the main point they will pick out, but them say yeah, it's something to be celebrated, but it will come with challenges, you see? So that you have to be those words 
So in the world you have to look out for them selling. Economic challenges and all of that. Yes, yeah, so they might talk about the whole um, carbon emission thing. Right. Carbon all footprint. The carbon footprint and the whole carbon emission thing. Then and um, climate change because hey, the, the population. Then and all these things, man. Right. So basically, you, you can see where they are going. Right. Then and I'm bringing this whole CBDC thing heavily now. Right. right. You know. You know. Say so, you no know, soon. Even I'm out in Jamaica, you're gonna see the whole um, social credit. School thing, you know, because you know, so called Jamaicans out here push that thing, our leaders are pushed it, you know, this digital currency thing heavy, right? So, ESA is putting things into place, you know, fast, rapidly right now, you know, to basically bring in the digital society to get rid of the majority of people because, you know, according to the scripture, the scripture said, um, many more of them are perishing in this lifetime because, you know, when things start to get really serious in the society, you know, and you have total chaos, a lot of people are going to get destroyed. Right? So it's not going to be an no easy, easy slide to right, the things that are going to basically take place according to what we in the scripture. Right? For sure it's going to be a mass slaughtering right? in the time to come. Because the people say many more of them will perish than what we going to basically get delivered right, in the time to come. If the scripture goes and say the righteous are going to scarcely be saved. That's how serious the time is going to be. The time we are approaching right now. I go on, brother. Yes. Like as a wave is greater than a drop. Like as a wave is greater than a drop. Right? Look, the compare a wave to a drop of water. Right? Like as a real drop. You know? That's how much people are get destroyed compared to how much I get delivered. Right? Way more people are get destroyed than what I get delivered any time to come. Right? You go on, brother. So second is 5 and 1. It says, Nevertheless, as, con as coming, Token, then, behold, the day shall come that they which dwell upon the earth Son. shall be taken in a great number. Be taken in a great number. Right. Then, One. And the way of truth shall be hidden, Son. and the land shall be barren of faith. People say the land is going to be barren of faith. Right? The things that are going to happen, a lot of people are going to lose their faith. You know, we, we yes. in this truth, you know, we hope and pray how about Shemir Shai, you know, give us, you know, that strength. He didn't do the work until the end because even Yahweh Shai said, right, going back 2000 years ago, Yahweh Shai said, he said, nevertheless, when the Son of Man come, shall he find faith and he hurt because a lot of people are going to lose it. A lot of people are going to basically like, bug out and give up. You know, chew away. You know, even this truth and take this digital device because that's where we're heading towards, right? When he saw him going to make this karagma, right, this digital device, monetary. We mentioned in Revelation 13. Right and um and 16 and down. That's where we're heading. So a lot of people want to lose faith. Right? We hope and pray, you know, we continue on this path until the end. The scripture said, um, give diligence to make a calling and election sure. Right? One. Yeah. It says, but iniquity shall be increased and? above that which no no sees. And we see how iniquity you yeah? know yeah. taking over this hurt right now and to live that way reach. Are, are that thou has heard long ago see? and the land that thou seest now to have root shall thou see wasted suddenly yes. so everything is you know uh, yeah, the, time, the time I come everything I get wasted a lot of people I get wasted from here right. and the Lord I used to bring forth all of this we be through the so-called white man yeah. Right. So they even follow you. Yeah. These men are you know, in control. Scripture tell you. And in um, Isaiah 10. Alright, that um, 10 and, 10 and, and uh, 5. So the Lord said, I'm going to send the Assyrian. She basically married the Assyrians out, the so called white man, against yeah. an hypocritical nation, against our people. Which are basically enough is, you know, on the earth right now. Which is right. So Revelation 12 and verse 12. One. It says, Therefore rejoice ye heaven, and he that dwell in them, woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you. Can't so say the devil is come down unto you, talking about you. You know, Esau, Edom, which is the so-called white man, 
we are getting ready to basically go all out against us. Our people. Mm -hmm. Having great wrath Can? because he know that he had but a short time. So he know he have a short time. So he have a short time in order to accomplish you know them NWO. The last right? Joy of people which is but for a, a moment. moment. Can? Yeah. And they them getting ready now to basically come up all out against us. The last time set a bone when he cannot pass. Can? Right? Give me a sit there, brother. Psalms 83, they quoted earlier. It's in the book of Psalms 83 and 1. Psalms 83 and 1. Psalms of Asaph. It says, Keep not thou silence, O Lord, O Yahweh. Hold not thy peace. In, and be not still, O power, for lo, thine enemies have made a tumult. Because of thine enemies have made a tumult, our enemies. Right, they're going to give you a list of our enemies. Right, all these nations that hate us. Go on. You have made a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up their head. They have taken crafty counsel. That's why them is glad, that's why they saw me get it. 64 it says um, deliver deliver me from the secret council of the wicked of the wicked God, mm -hmm. from the insurrection of the workers of iniquity. Yeah. We, 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 we are fight a we are fight a spiritual battle in this truth. The scriptures are wrestling not against flesh and blood. Um but against principalities, against force, against princi um, um wickedness. Spiritual wickedness. Spiritual, spiritual wickedness in high places. places it says, um, For lo, thine enemies has made a tumult, Can? and they that hated thee have lifted up their head. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. So when they crafty counsel against the Lord's people, right? Against, you know, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, you know, Native American Indian. Right? This agenda we see pushing, right now, this NWO agenda, right? Where they are planning to basically, you know, bring in right now, using even all these puppet leaders across the world, right? Basically, you know, do certain things, you know, in order yeah. to get certain things done, right? It's crafty the counts against us, right? Easy, like one. Okay. Uh, craft the counsel against thy people Go on. And, and consulted against thy hidden ones Go on. they have said come and let us cut them off from being a nation so this is what the elites are planning to do right to get rid of us all together right going back to the you know the charger guys soon to get destroyed say so maintain humanity and 500 million Go on. right and they come out that we have 8 billion people right now presently on the earth so they're going to do a lot of things in order to basically get rid of the majority of the earth population. Mm. Right? Goal number one, you know, and the stuff still of a development goal, is to get rid of poverty. Right? Mm. And then we're going to bring in, then we're bring in um, um, universal basic income. So UBI. our people, UBI. God, our people is not going to basically be a part of this new system or this new way of life where they are basically planning mm. to bring about. It's not about our people. Even, even our leaders will think that some of them are going to be a part of it, they're not going to use it. Right? In, in, a, in, a, in a them thing. They're going to basically use them now. They're going to use them to basically push for their agenda, but they're not going to right. basically be a part of you know, what they're basically planning. Right? Yeah, they them know they them know, so are still of the house of Israel. Right? They're going to use it for the time being. Right. Use it and then get rid of you. It's in, a, right? in a nation um, that the name of Israel be, may be no more that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance Gun. for they have consulted together with one consent Gun, all them they are confederate against thee so all them in league, you, all these hidden nations and league that's you know, join the visa, you don't forget rid of us Gun. and that's, that's why when I go back to um, even the book of Obadiah that tells us uh, about Edom, the Lord said he made, made thee um, small among the hidden but they, they are greatly despised we go down to verse what, 6 or 7 tell us um, the, the, even the men of thy confederacy then, alliance yeah. them are going to turn against him man. Yeah. the Lord are going to turn them against each other then, as they written the Lord he going to turn them one against another right. for the things they going to do to them being chosen man. Then, so he thinks he thinks he it, it go according to his plan but it's not going to go that way then. then he says um 
the tabernacle of Edom and the Ishmaelites of, of Moab so. and the, and the Agarines. So this is a list of the all our enemies, yeah. yeah. Right? The tabernacle of Edom, which are the so-called white people, in the list, number one enemy of the nation of Israel. Right, the Moabite, right, the so-called Chinese, Ishmaelites, um, um, Ishmaelites, Arabs, one. Agarines, the Agarines, um, um, so called Africans, Amites, so called Africans, and go on, says Jibal and Amman, Zin, and Amalek, Amalek, yeah, right, these small acts, small acts, right. them men, Amalek, them are one of the ones that the Lord eat the most, them are part of Edom, them are part of Edom, men, Zin, Zin, the Philistines with, with the inhabitants of Tyre, go on, three and three. He says, he says, uh, he says, Ashur also is joined with them. They have all been the children of Lot. Verse 12 says, He says, Who said, verse 12 says, Who said, Let us take to ourselves the houses of God in possession. Son. He says, Oh my God, Son. make them like a wheel. So as it's stubble before the wind. Can say so, Pastor, let, it, uh, let, it, let us take the house of God in their possession. Can. Right? In uh, in um, the scripture in um, Revelation. Revelation, I think, a Revelation um, 11. A Revelation 11 and 10. He said, the, they said, they rejoice and send gifts one to another. Can. Right? So these two prophets tormented them. Right? So they gladly afflict us. So now, we need time now when all them over us, right? And they want to get rid of us all together because, you know, believe it or not, all these Eden nation know, right? The, the, the top leaders for, for these Eden nation, they know that we are the true biblical Israelites, right? The scripture even goes as far as say, none, none said restore. Okay. So none of them will care about us because they all them glad, right? All them glad for basically have us, you know, in this situation or this lifestyle of in right now. Right, but we know the time now when the Heavenly Father, right, the how we train, so the how we shall get in the elect. Right? And the scripture says what well, great fear fall upon them when they saw us. When they see us coming back to our true power, great fear fell upon them because they know. From once, as I mentioned earlier and from once you write it off for them can do nothing against us here because going back to the time of King David to Solomon, we have all these nations tributary unto us. Right? And that's that's what they basically going back to do. Right, be our servant. Right, finish? It's in, um, okay. So with that, may I say all praises and honor to you, Ahu Bashim, Ahu Shai Bashim, Ahu Kakodash. And double honors to the apostles, to the elders, to the women, to the women, to all the brothers and all the Shalom also to, you know, a few sisters. Right? Shalom. Shalom.